So right now, the BRC20 token economy is skyrocketing. And we're looking here at three BRC20 tokens that need your attention. I don't know how else to explain this to you, but BRC20 tokens are making people a lot of money right now. And most of them are meme coins, it's true. However, there is one huge benefit for the market from these coins. These BRC20 tokens are changing the game for Bitcoin. And today we're highlighting three BRC20 projects that we really like and that we believe in and that we feel there's a ton of potential behind. And only one of them happens to be a meme coin. Welcome to the channel. My name is Maddie. This is Altcoin Buzz. Do not forget about our new partnership with Bybit. They are giving away $30,000 in bonuses. You also stand a chance to win a new iPhone 14. Check out the links in the description of this video or stick around till the end and I'll explain it in a little more detail. I wish you all the best of luck if you choose to invest, whether it's in these BRC20 tokens or any of the other projects that we talk about regularly on this channel. But obviously I am not a financial or investment advisor. So do not take this video to be official financial or investment advice. And the first project that we're looking at today is Ordi, O-R-D-I. But first things first, let's clarify here. The Ordinals wallet site is not just a place to get one of the compatible Ordinals Bitcoin wallets. It's also kind of like the open sea of Ordinals. So it's a marketplace in other words. And you can't use just any Bitcoin wallet. You need one that enables the taproot update. And then you can mint, you can buy, or you can sell an Ordinal. So like I said, the first project that we're looking at is Ordi, O-R-D-I is the token. And it's a very important project for BRC20 and for ordinals holistically. It's the first project and by far the largest by market value. As you can see here, as I record, it's worth over $300 million by market cap. And unlike some of the BRC20 meme coins, there's real value in Ordi and lots of it. For example, each Ordi is backed by one Satoshi. And a Satoshi, as you probably know, is the lowest value, the lowest incremental value of a Bitcoin. There are 100 million Satoshis for every Bitcoin, and therefore one Satoshi equals one 100 millionth of a BTC. Ordi also has value in being a payment coin within the BRC20 ecosystem. There are 21 million of them, just like Bitcoin, and the current price sits at a little under $14. In this example here, we're playing around with the marketplace part of ordinalwallets.com. All three of our coins on this list today are here, by the way, in this column available for sale in the marketplace. We see some important information here. All 21 million Ordi are minted and available in circulating supply. That's good to know. We see the inscription address, which we can check on Ordi scan to verify its accuracy and that we're not buying a scam version of the coin. It's important to do that. Next, we see prices listed by lowest price per Ordi. And here, that price is $16.30, but it's for 5,000 of them. The total cost is 3.02 BTC. And one of the smaller orders on the page is 50 Ordi, as you can see, for a cost of 0.0318 BTC, or about $17 each. Seeing this marketplace of orders shows us one of the differences between not having smart contract functionality. ERC20 for ETH has it, but BRC20 does not. And that means you cannot interact with the contract and only buy one if you want. You can buy all of what they're offering or none. It's one or the other. But you can search by price, amount of the inscription, or by most recent listing. The most recent could be a deal to get some Ordi4 transactions later if someone minted and maybe wants to sell them right away. Project number two that we're looking at today is VMPX. This is that meme coin that I was alluding to earlier. And generally speaking, we tend to avoid meme coins on altcoin buzz, but if we're talking about it here, there must be something good about it or something to it. It's not Pepe. It's VMPX, and this might be the highest risk coin that we have ever discussed on the channel, but we also feel that it could be worth your attention. And I'm not kidding when I say that because meme coins can really go to zero just as quickly as they can 100x, 200x, maybe even more. But that said, VMPX is a vampire-based meme coin project, yes. And here's why we're talking about it today. 
It has the highest number of contributors and holders of any BRC20 project. That's including Ordi, if you can believe that. It has a market cap of just under $19 million and a price of 17 cents. Despite its low market cap, though, it has the second highest volume of transactions in BRC20 right now. So that's pretty impressive. And the coin's creator, a gentleman by the name of Jack Levin, is the founder of Zen Crypto, X-E-N. He's one of crypto's good guys, and he's the founder of the Fair Crypto Foundation, and he's got many, many fans in the industry. A lot of people in the crypto space, perhaps even yourself, like to follow personality-driven memes, kind of like when Elon Musk shills Dogecoin. In this case, we have an example of a real crypto guy with a side project he's not even shilling. He isn't, but his fans are. That's the thing. And last but not least, project number three on our list is SHNT. This is our third BRC20 coin for today. And it's another coin with a 21 million fixed supply limit and another with utility for us. So notice how many projects have 21 million tokens limit, I guess in tribute to Bitcoin ultimately. In this case, SHNT is a cool NFT project and very small. Its market cap right now is only about $1.3 million and it trades at about 6.5 cents. So very modest numbers, a lot of upward price potential, obviously. Now here's the utility part. You can use your SHNT as an NFT research tool to search your Satoshis in your wallet to see how rare they are. We've seen in the conventional NFT market how much rarity can affect the price, and having tools like this only helps get us closer to price discovery in these kinds of markets where we can get true value. Here, Due to the cheaper price, we see larger groupings of SHNT available for sale, like 5,000 for 0 0.012 BTC, or about 6 cents each, or 20,000 here at 0 0.0509 BTC at about 7 cents each. And one last cool thing about the Ordinal Wallets Marketplace is you see on the screen here how you can go to the Ordi Scan or Uniset and validate the contract before you buy it. That's a nice customer protection before you click on the I still want to buy tab and finish your purchase. Once again, our tip is to make sure you have a Taproot compatible Bitcoin wallet and then you can check out Ordinals for yourself. It is an ecosystem that we increasingly have a lot of confidence in. Just want to remind you once again, and as I talked about at the beginning of the video, you can win up to $30,000. Just click the link in the description below and if you have any further doubts or questions, you can also check out our dedicated and detailed explainer video. I will also include that in the description.